You know that Imam Ahmed, rahimahullah, the founder of the fiqh school, the Hanbalis, he was of the personal opinion that you do not recite the Bismillah. You don't recite it out loud. You recite it silently. Imam al-Shafi'i was the opposite opinion. He said, no, you have to recite it out loud. Imam Ahmed was the student of Imam al-Shafi'i. And so Imam Ahmed, whenever he was traveling in the Muslim lands and he was going through a place that was mostly populated by people who followed Imam al-Shafi'i, he would recite the Bismillah in the prayer. Even though that wasn't his opinion, because he understood that this diversity was accepted that this was not the disunity that Allah Azawajal was blaming in the Quran. This was not the disunity that the Prophet was warning us about.